Hey everybody, DSJ here. Technically, it's not a random play, but just want to talk about some things. As you can see, I am playing Infamous Second Son, which I'm not gonna lie, I'm having fun with this game. I really am having fun with this game. But anyway, if y'all follow my Twitter, y'all would know I now ha have the PS4. Matter of fact, I got it Tuesday. On top of that, I ordered my QV. Uh, no, I ordered my PS4 through QVC. So it came with two other, well, besides this one, it came with two other games, which is Knack. And what's the other one? Killzone Shadowfall. Now, I'm not gonna lie. There's a lot of things I already like about this system. Grant, I still hate the whole um install the damn this thing, but the PS3 has done have done it too with a lot of their games. So I can't fault the PS4 for that. Then I can fault it for the amount of memory it takes. Cause this thing is only 500 gigab gigabytes. Which eventually I'll probably um uh, I'll probably upgrade it to one gig, maybe two gigs when I have the money. I like the way the um I like the way the um PlayStation Store is more well PlayStation Store is no different than the PS3 PlayStation Store. But it kinda enters it more seamlessly and Instead of go through a whole daggone loading screen. Oh yeah. Sp speaking of installing, the install speed is a lot faster than the PS4 would ever be. Oh yeah, yeah, drug dealer. They drug bust anybody? Oh, damn, they shooting at me too. As you can see, I'm taking the hero route. But do I recommend everybody, anybody to get a PS4? I'm like this. I thought about this system when it was announced in last year's E3 conference. But yeah, I did end up getting the Xbox One first. But you know what? It is what it is. All those systems are good in their own right. Just well. It's like the bulk of the games I want to get for this system, as well as the Xbox One is not coming out till next year. Why the Wii U still has my interest in games I'm gonna get for this year? And Sony still releasing PS3 games and remaking them in the um, PlayStation 4 games. And yes, the Xbox One have that same problem. I'm like this. The main reason why a lot of people's not getting these on um, newer gen systems is mainly because you're making the same damn game for the previous generation. And at this point, I could truly call the Wii, the 360, and the PS3 previous generation. But 
I mean, yeah, I mean, for real. Release some original games for the system. That was the perfect start, but then y'all start re-releasing stuff like, oh my god. Tomb Raider, again? Granted, it's sequel, I think it's gonna be an exclusive. to do that. I want to clear this to be zero. I just wish they stopped doing it. I mean, granted, the fact they fought on the PlayStation, Sony in general is finally getting their hands on the, um, the better version of Resident Evil 1 that Nintendo had for years. First of the GameCube, then re-released on the Wii. You know what? Like I said, just make some original content for these games. Oh yeah, another thing. If if any of y'all already friends with me on on a PlayStation Network when I have my PS3, I still have it by the way. I ain't giving that up no time soon. My PlayStation Network name is still DSJ120682. That has not changed. It's the same case for the PlayStation 4. As far as how I handle my stuff on the PlayStation Network, it's pretty much the same rules I did with my 360 as well as one. Granted, I do have Skype on the one, but... Anyway, for right now, fuck Skype. But here's the thing. Party chats, I don't do. I never have done them before. I don't think I'm going to start now. Mainly for one reason. I buy video game systems to play the games. If I want to chat with anybody, once I get my... Well, once I get the Skype on my computer up and running, God be damned if I turn on my Xbox One for that, I'll chat with y'all with on Skype. I will play um, online matches with people if they have the game I own. However, I will not play the following games online. Any first person shooter. Because I already seen some retarded mess happen like a SWAT team was called on. Yeah, SWAT team was called on somebody mainly because they would lose it in Call of Duty. Which, that is fucking crazy to me. I'm like this, just take the loss and be done with him. Who the hell's shooting? Why is going to say drug bust and I ain't get them all? Anyway. But yeah, those are my rules and expectations for that. Like I said, I'm not playing no Call of Duty or any first person shooter with anybody online. Cause I don't know about to call the SWAT team on me, and I end up getting my uh, a, 
apartment bust through because someone's a sore loser. Now I play fighting games against anybody any day. I ain't gonna lie to you. MMOs I don't do. That's point blank. I will never do an MMO. Ever. And like and I like to say again, I don't do party chats either. However, I don't mind if anybody send me messages through through PSN. I don't mind that at all. But party chats, no. I'm a t well. I'll be honest with you. The main reason why I don't do party chats, cause when I had my 360, and when I tried to um, and when I tried to record. Someone want to bust through on um, and do a party chat during recording? It annoys me mainly because one, I'm trying to record. I know I'm not the best let's play in the world, but it's kind of hard to even, you know, try to do a deck on chat and a walkthrough at the same time. It just doesn't work. That's my personal opinion. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close out this video. Got to get this tracker drone. And end up under here somehow. Until then, i see you guys later. Expect some mini reviews or some um, let's plays with with this system. Oh yeah, I do have tests for this, but I'll be damned if I play that. Cause you know why? Fuck fish. That's all I gotta say. I know about that scandal. That's why I say fuck them. <laughs>